Welcome back everyone, Christine here on Serious Gaming, continuing my let's play of Ultimate Admiral Age of Sail. Okay, I have a lot of ships uh, right here. This one in particular just needs a captain. I'm gonna take someone who doesn't have his statistics maxed out because I want to be able to level them up. So I do have quite a few people that are 100 that I am not going to use. I do have a fairly serious naval battle that at the end of the previous video, I kind of like just ignored pretty much, <laughs> just just flat out uh, ignored that one. So I do have a bunch of trophies. I obviously want to keep the, keep the 68 gunships of the line. Um, maybe the Cornwall would really be good in this. Right, so we have the Saint, the Cornwall, the San Antonio, all that kind of stuff that would be good. So I'm going to give the Cornwall a crew and maybe change the guns a bit, maybe, anyway. Uh, yeah, go with some people that are highly competent. No, not 100 level competent. The guys that do have 100, I think I'm gonna put them on another ship. So I have the Cornwall, the Andalus, the San Gennaro and uh, Arbogante. So I have two 68 gunships, two 48 gun, uh, 40, or one 48 gunship and one 46. So I have some fifth rate ships, actually a fourth rate uh, ship and two third rate ships. Uh, one of which, like one of these ships doesn't have upgrades. I can't actually buy anything here. Now it's kind of getting to the point of ridiculousness. Like I have so uh, like in virtually every battle that I fought recently, I have been dealing with um, 68 gunships, 64 guns. Like the game has a weird thing. Like it treats them as 64 guns. Like when it, they were introduced, like it's oh, it's a 64 gun ship, but in reality, it really isn't. So anyway, I am going to take two of my biggest ships and two of my smaller ones. 230 cannons, 1,540 men, let's do it. When I send ships to escort a merchant in the Bermudas full of rum bat barrels, it seemed an easy task. A simple rendezvous and escort slightly complicated by multiple sandbanks in the area. Okay. Who could have thought that the rebels would intercept our rum so boldly? It does not seem that they have had to climb aboard, so we just need to distract them long enough for the merchant's crew to get under sail. That's actually going to be a bit trickier than you might assume. Hopefully, playing cat and mouse in the shallows will prove more difficult for the rebels than us. So we've got shallow seas. The wind is blowing in that direction. We've got the USS Alexander, the USS Bart, the USS... Ariane. So we've got three ships of the line over here and one smaller ship as well. And we also have the HMS Pearl, which is stuck <laughs> over there, and unfortunately. So what can I do? All right, gonna try and actually get it out. I mean, it's not gonna do a lot. Hmm. Yep, so move them and get them moving. All right, so full sail. Let's get this going. So they've lost uh, 90 men to, to take control there. And yeah, so the good thing there is they've lost quite a few men. Now they've got this ship coming in. Oh, this is gonna be bad because you do see what's going what's going to happen here. So the shallow waters. Yeah, just gonna stop it. No point in wasting a good ship. Actually just gonna fuck the formation really. Hold on. Let me just wait. Cause we see this ship coming in. They're gonna try and escape. Now I don't want to get myself involved in a in a too bad situation over here. So I'm gonna going to take these guys and I'm just going to get them closer so that they can board some enemy ships. Alright. 
So at Andalus, the good thing about it... All right. All right, so the wind is blowing in that direction. I have an advantage over it. Stop there. Stop there. Okay. Alright, bring, uh, bring the Andalus around, get the Cornwall out of there.
All right, so. I'm going to bring the HMS, the USS Alexander Redder to bear. I'm going to bring the Cornwall. All right, hold on. Bad idea, really. That's a better idea. Oh, they're... They're destroying my sails, huh? And that one is basically finished. Oh, so they've managed to disentangle themselves by the looks of it. Well, that's not good. Let me try and get to... Alright, so they both surrendered. Good. Well, I mean, I could always capture it, even if it's going to be a trophy. Hold on. If it's stuck there, and it is, 
and it does look like it is it is stuck there. Why not uh, take advantage of the situation? Ugh. Because actually firing on the thing is gonna be a pain, eh? Try shooting. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> Shallow water with the wind pu pushing in that direction? Yeah, that's really not gonna happen. Oh, I need to be very careful there, actually. Oh, shit. It is shallow, that's the problem. <laughs> what a wonderful situation here, <laughs> really. Yeah, getting it there is not going to happen so easily. Now with the wind being in that direction. Huh. I can't take it here, it's shallow. Yeah, let's just turn this baby around. Probably the best thing is to send it here, honestly. Try and escape like that. Because there are... All I need to do is just retreat with it, honestly. Or I could just send it here. Let's see if that works. Don't know if it will. What I really need to do is get past the shallow water though. With the wind coming in that direction, it's going to be a bit tricky. Yeah, so I need to get past this, and I can't go straight like this, left nothing more. Do you- what are you doing, Cornwall? <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna do anything, just get the fuck out of there. What is this ship doing? Stop! Oh, fucking AI, I see, I understand. Oh shit, that's bad. That is actually fucking terrible. So I don't want it to get smashed by the ship with the line, I need to get the, the fuck out of here. Well, it's moving very slowly.
All right, it is a bad position that I've gotten myself in. And victory is certain. It's just gonna be very, very slow. Just gonna be careful here. Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, just send it over there. It will make it eventually. Once we get past the shallows, I can speed it up. Also capture the Jean Bart as well. Seems like a combination of American and French ships, really. Well, if it surrenders before I have to kill the entire crew, then that would be certainly ideal. 360 left. I think this mission sounded greater in their heads than it actually is honest, for the developers. Is. The reason it can't move is the wind is pushing it like that. There's some sh shallow stuff here, there's shallows behind it. I don't know how you how they even got themselves in that position honestly. They should frankly surrender by this stage. Well, good news. All right, so that's as far as I can go. And that's gonna start gaining speed now. Shooting at the prow of a ship is not necessarily the wisest decision one can make. But look at it, it's been decimated. All but a matter of time now.
the hilarious part is that although I'm sh shooting round shots, the actual ship has taken pretty much no damage. Well, some at the front, obviously. But really, it doesn't count. I'm gonna do something very reckless and stupid now, but... Maybe it will work, maybe it won't. If I can bring the... If I can get in, in... Yep. In range. Just gotta get past those shallows there. 84 crew. Like what I want is grape shot. I was not fancying the idea of fighting the, you know, fighting it one on one. Could have done this earlier. I'm not gonna deny that. But that's the reason why I didn't want to do it earlier. Would have lost a lot of men for it. barely doing any damage. Might have to bring the Andalus. No, it's not enough. I need to break its armor. But they're gonna probably get break mine before I do. Yeah, you stop right there. I'm gonna take down this ship. more of its armor do I need to take down? Alright, let's try again. Rape shot.
I still don't get how they are doing so little damage with their grape shots. I mean, its armor is destroyed. I might have well just... Like, I thought that if I brought it side by side, the grape shot would just finish it out very quickly. Clearly, I was wrong. So very, very wrong. Alright, just gonna destroy it then. Well, I sunk it. I would have really have liked to have captured it, but uh, yeah, just wasn't working. Anyway, I mean, I tried. Holy hell, did I try? <laughs> Probably should have just kept it all going, right? An award, the Distinguished Order uh, Service Order. Mm hmm. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, 
Yeah. So it's got a pretty significant crew, this one. The with B. It's not like it has a significantly higher capacity. All right. Let's get some of that. Okay. All right, so I am going to Well, I'm going to need to go, actually. Costine here, signing out. Thank you all for watching, and stay tuned for more. That certainly took a lot longer than it honestly should have.